This morning, new questions in the Trump shooting investigation. According to lawmakers briefed by the FBI, the Secret Service knew the shooter was on a roof nearby 20 minutes before he took his first shots. He should have been eliminated one way or the other within one or two or three minutes. So the only thing I can come up with is just a total breakdown of communication. Lawmakers say the FBI has provided this timeline. At 5.10 p.m., Crooks is first identified as a person of interest, a full 62 minutes before the first shots. At 5.30, he's spotted with a rangefinder, which can be used to determine distances for target practice. Sources say he was able to get on that roof by climbing over air conditioning units. At 5.52, he's spotted on the roof by the Secret Service, a full 20 minutes before the shooting. At 6.02, Trump takes the stage. 6.12, Crooks fires those shots. A sniper then killed Crooks 26 seconds after he fired the first shot. Secret Service Director Kim Cheadle has agreed to testify Monday on Capitol Hill as she faces more calls to resign. Sources say a search of the shooter's phone revealed he had looked up the date of Trump's rally, as well as dates for the Democratic National Convention in Chicago. But still, a motive for the attack remains unclear. Andrea Fuji, ABC News, New York.